Watching this video, we are about to learn what to do and what not to do while in or around other cars. So buckle up and let's get it on. And this is why you should pay attention to rail crossings. On the bright side, at least he didn't get a parking ticket. At least everyone was safe. This is an incident where a train collided with a semi-truck in Moody, Texas. It's good that no injuries and the train did not derail. I can't believe how much people don't pay attention. Maybe people didn't even care that they collided and continued to go on. Oh my, the truck was carrying more than two tons of bricks and the road surface may not have been able to bear the weight due to the soil erosion. No way! The truck driver didn't feel anything. The red car will certainly have plenty of time to rethink its choice. Fortunately, there were no injuries. What a nightmare! Can't believe they are all still alive. Reckless overtaking can lead to incidents like that. Always prioritize safety. Thankfully, no pedestrians on that sidewalk. Hope everyone is safe. Who is at fault? Let me know in the comments below. Oh, the blue. Scania multi-lift driver decided to overtake and cross a straight road line, which is illegal, without checking his back view mirrors. At least everyone was safe. The car was a Renault Clio. For an unknown reason until it was oncoming traffic, it collided with many vehicles. Thankfully, all of them survived. No! Drive safe and always pay attention to what is going on around you. Fortunately, there were no injuries. Fortunately, no collision occurred. Incredible, no one was hurt. The driver jumped out of the vehicle before it exploded. The driver was driving along Heels Road near Bundaberg, Queensland, when a flooded river suddenly appeared. Fortunately, he was okay. Uh. Wow, the devastating power of tanks is no joke. Uh. Well, it's good to see people trying to warn truck drivers. The gray sedan pulled over for speeding violation, and a minivan struck the back of the car as the officer went to write a citation. Fortunately, there were no injuries. To prevent this, maintain proper tire pressure and inspect tires regularly. It's admirable how quickly the car's driver responded. Fortunately, there were no injuries. Oh no! Thankfully, everyone was fine. Great job, man! That was so close! How lucky he is! In California, police are chasing an apparent carjacked Amazon delivery van. Hope no one gets hurt. 
This car being boxed in by police rammed two patrol cars and escaped efforts to arrest the driver in Port Orchard, Washington. A reckless U-turn nearly led to a severe incident. Ensure there is ample visibility and enough space. It's good to see the car turn the other way. Looks like someone forgot their car, but luckily nobody was in the car. Oh my god! Oh my god! Wow, the thickness of the snow surprised me. Oh, vehicle maintenance is paramount to prevent such dangerous incidents. The best thing in those cases is, if you don't have chains, is to lower the tire pressure a lot. This gives you more traction. There's not enough room to do a U-turn in the split entry exit roads. he eventually found out. It's important to have safe driving habits and obeying traffic laws and respecting fellow road users. Do not imitate this. Always check the rear and side mirrors. Look over your shoulder and you should be okay. You may only change lanes when you do not hinder any other traffic. Drivers in Missouri change lanes without looking. Be careful on the road and pay attention to your surroundings. The black car driver was like, oh, well, I didn't see the red lights. It's not my fault. Hmm, running a red light won't save you guys time. I think the driver should not move the lane continuously for a short time. Do not imitate this. Apparently, if there is no fence, I don't know what bad things will happen to the cars running on the road. Glad they were not injured. No injuries were reported after a car crashed through a dead-end barrier and landed on its roof when it fell over a hill at the end of a dead-end street in San Francisco. But I feel sorry for the trees. We have a lesson here that we should stop at red lights. Glad he is okay. these situations, you should always leave a bigger gap between yourself and the car in front. Don't worry, no one was injured. You can see a Lamborghini on the frontage. It's running at quite a fast speed. After a short time, the vehicle veered off the frontage into a shallow saltwater marsh on exit 4 just off Galveston Island. It's a good thing Eddie was okay. An incredibly rare Bugatti trying to switch lanes with a very little room to do so collided with the BMW in Suzhou, China. But I don't get it. Why didn't the BMW driver let him switch lanes? Oh my god. Luckily Volvo has good brakes, so both drivers were not seriously hurt. 
2001 Toyota Tundra truck struck the side of a marked Unit 816. Luckily, neither the officer nor the 63-year-old operator of the truck were injured as a result of the incident. Oh no, a car fell into the sea when attempting to board a ferry that was pulling away from the port in Istanbul, Turkey. I feel bad for their incident. The red car collided with the white car while trying to cross the street in Dubai. This is the reason while driving we should observe vehicles. Oh my goodness! I don't know why the driver was in a hurry to drive so fast, but do not worry, no one got hurt. Do not imitate this. Oh no! Red Ferrari should be careful in order not to cause multi-vehicle accidents in Melbourne. Thankfully, everybody is okay and nobody was hurt. Unbelievable! There were no streetlights in the area, no sign of hazards, no warning lights, literally nothing. Thank God the driver is still safe. Jesus! This is the moment a car hurtled off a road, bounced over the roofs of three stationary vehicles, but no injuries were reported. It's careless to drive a truck over power lines without paying attention. Fortunately, no one was seriously injured. Tesla self-immolated and exploded in a parking garage in Shanghai, China. Don't worry, no one was injured. This is the lesson that does not stop in the middle of the highway. Do not imitate this. A car crashed in Abu Dhabi after a sudden lane change. Do not imitate this. In the video, the sedan has spun around after it lost control while evading another car in Houston, Texas. Nobody was injured. I hope you learned his lesson and will drive more carefully next time. So this is the video urging drivers to avoid swerving suddenly. Nobody was injured. What is he thinking? Do not imitate this. A truck reversed without noticing the vehicle behind. The dash cam saves the driver. But the real hero was the white road marker. This is really trippy to watch without it. A van backs into the car and damages the bumper and trunk. Originally, they seemed cooperative, but after receiving a quote for repairs, all of a sudden, they stopped replying. The increasing popularity of electric cars raises concerns about lithium-ion battery fires. In such incidences, it's vital for firefighters to be trained in handling these unique fires using specialized equipment and techniques. Luckily, no one was injured in the situation. The driver of this rental truck ignored the 25 mile per hour speed limit and all the low clearance warnings. Drive safely. Do not do that again. And this is a similar case. Fortunately, there was only a minor mishap and nobody was hurt. Driving carefully, motorcyclists. That is scary.
Proper tire maintenance is essential to prevent blowouts. Luckily, no one was hurt. To uh, minimize the risk of such accidents, regularly inspected and maintained tires, ensuring they are in good condition. Safety on the road is essential. Don't duplicate that, man. There were no injuries when a loose wheel from a pickup truck smashed into the windshield of a car on the highway. Oh my. A fortunate incident where a warning sign fell onto a vehicle, but the driver was fine. Always be aware of your surroundings and be prepared for unexpected situations on the road. Wow, genuinely a concern when driving down a road lined with gum trees in the summer. Luckily, the driver was okay. This is appalling. I can't even imagine what it's like in real life. Thankfully, there was no collision. That was too close. This was very nearly a collision. Fortunately, they avoided it. Oops, a near miss car accident on the highway was narrowly avoided, highlighting the importance of checking blind spots. No, this is why everyone should practice emergency braking. Do not worry, everyone was fine. My goodness, just imagine that a van crossing just one second later. That would have been horrible. Luckily, no one was hurt. This is a rear end collision that occurred on Washington Avenue. <coughs> to prevent such incidents, always keep a significant gap between vehicles. Thankfully, no one was hurt. A head-on collision involving an SUV occurred at 26801 Calaroga, Hayward, California, when a northbound driver fell asleep at the wheel. But do not worry, both drivers were safe. It appeared that the Jeep slowed and stopped while the car continued forward, resulting in the collision. Fortunately, nobody got hurt. This video was recorded on southbound Interstate 85 in North Carolina. It certainly doesn't pay to be a distracted driver. Thankfully, everyone was okay. Oh my god, the driver lost control due to slamming on the brakes. Remember to brake gradually and maintain control of your vehicle. Luckily, all of them were fine. <laughs> Who's at fault here? Let me know in the comments below. Well, the driver should have braked to avoid colliding with the rear of the van that was in front of him, which was already well on the roundabout. Fortunately, both drivers were fine. An inattentive driver collided with the parked car in front of a house. Always stay focused on the road. Be aware of surroundings, especially in residential areas. But do not worry, nobody was injured. Oh dear, what was he thinking? Being prepared for unexpected actions by other drivers are crucial steps to enhance safety. An out of control UTE collides with a tree on Beachboro Street. Responsible driving is key to ensuring safety for yourself and others on the road. The drunk driver was just too drunk to drive and drove into a no parking sign and hit the power pole. Do not imitate this guys. Fortunately, the driver was unscathed. Oh dear, a Warren County man drove his SUV into a home. The advice here, always drive responsibly, obey traffic laws. Thankfully, no one got hurt. When driving on icy roads, reduce speed significantly. 
increase following distance, and avoid sudden movements. Glad that no one was injured. Poor trees. Always stay focused and vigilant while driving. The vehicle suffered a sudden tire blowout, leading to a loss of control. Regular tire maintenance can also help prevent such incidents. If you ever find yourself losing control while driving, remember to stay calm, avoid sudden movements, and regain control gradually. In this situation, it appears the driver lost control, but do not worry, no one was hurt. Gentle steering and braking are essential to maintaining control. Your safety is paramount. We have a lesson here. Regular tire maintenance and checking tire pressure can help prevent blowouts. the parking lot accident, would you be able to figure out what happened if you had not seen the dash cam? Be prepared for sudden stops or lane changes by the vehicle ahead. Luckily, no collision. Remember, keeping a safe distance helps us prevent accidents and ensures your safety on the road. And this is the same situation. As you can see, this is a situation where a bus collision unfolds at the Brattle Road and Brisham Road Junction. Fortunately, everyone was safe. No, someone ran a red light and caused a collision. Jesus Woo! Thankfully, no one was hurt. In Scotland, a blue hire car indicated a right turn on the A904 without noticing oncoming traffic. Luckily, no one was hurt. Oh no, the driver of the red car caused quite a commotion in the neighborhood and hastily departed after colliding with the vehicle parked in front of a residence's yard. It's possible that he's still affected by alcohol from the previous night. The circumstances leading to the driver's loss of control remain a mystery. If you have any information or insights into what might have caused this incident, please share your thoughts in the comments below. Oh no, a sudden break by the red car. Keep at least three second gap between your vehicle and the one in front. In adverse conditions, increase this distance. A stolen car crashes after trying and failing to take a bend at a high speed during a police chase. Please alert the police if you witness an instance like this. This live footage captures a miraculous moment as an incident unfolds. It appears the young car driver had a guardian angel that day. In an accident, a speeding driver was captured on camera driving against traffic through the Midtown Tunnel, colliding with an Uber vehicle and attempting to flee the scene. Luckily, no one was hurt.
No, I feel sorry for the red car. Thankfully, everyone was fine. Well, at least the driver will be insured. Do not worry, no one was injured. Driving on snow-covered roads demands extreme caution. Reduce your speed, increase following distance, and use winter tires if possible. Whoa! Dude! Oh no. I've always been curious as to why people can't see it or feel it while driving. Or do they accidentally push the wrong button? The truck turned left onto a military cutoff road in Wilmington, North Carolina, and snagged the overhead wires, causing sparks to fly into the air. The driver appeared oblivious to the damage. Absolutely maintaining a safe following distance is crucial for road safety. It gives you time to react to unexpected situations and helps prevent accidents like the one described earlier. What is he thinking? At roundabouts, sudden lane changes can often result in collisions like this. Oh my god! Seems the road is too narrow for this turn section. Thankfully, everyone was okay. This incident appears to be a manifestation of road rage. Let's hope that both parties involved can find a way to resolve their differences peacefully and remember their mutual respect. <laughs> Luckily, no one was hurt. Travo de Morte, situated on PR-423 in Campo Largo, has earned its ominous nickname due to frequent incidents primarily caused by driver inattention. I pray that everyone is safe. Be careful, everyone. A security camera recorded an accident on BR-470 in Paso Redona. Always adhere to speed limits, maintain focus, and exercise patience to prevent such incidents on the road. Thankfully, nobody was injured. Somehow the fact that they didn't bonk into each other made it even better. I think mostly because the innocent driver's car was untouched and the perpetrator was taught a lesson. You never know when unexpected situations will occur. So remember, keep a safe distance from the vehicle ahead and always travel at a reasonable speed. Hey, bus. Ah. What up? I bet he didn't check the rear view mirror. Yay! Glad they were not injured. Oh no! Runaway tire! No! Well, he's lucky. The tire didn't hit the other car and it even came back to the truck. Perhaps it's too late for him to realize his mistake. Thank you for watching videos from start to finish. Share your favorite moment in the comments below. If you've enjoyed this video, please show your appreciation by hitting the like button and subscribing to our channel. See you next video.